Hello everybody. So if you've been following my Orion project over at the Mooker Free Energy Forum, you've seen what I'm doing. Now I'm going to give a little demonstration here. Okay, I have this hooked up on brushes. Okay, two brushes at 90. Okay, that create magnetic rotation in the opposite direction as the physical motion. Okay, so every time I turn right, the magnetic field inside the armature goes left. Just as fast and they're mechanically linked. So, if you are familiar with how universal or DC motors work, you know that a brushed armature usually, always, except in this case, keep the magnetic field stationary, rather. So, every time the magnetic field moves a little bit, the brushes step it right back to where it was. That way, the field magnet is trying to pull the rotor to a line, but it never can, because every time it moves a little bit, the brush just steps it back, so it has to do it again and again and again, and it can never align maintaining a constant torque hence why dc motors take a permanent magnet and the field doesn't change and it's always trying to attract to that magnet but it never can because every time it moves the field moves back so it's got to move again and it can never get there but this actually rotates the field rotating this rotates the field on the outside counterclockwise or counter the physical rotation so i have a compass here okay that's from an outside perspective such as a stator so let's juice this up with about two and a half, three amps. Okay, and I'm going to turn this. As you can see, there is a rotating field. I'm going to turn it the other way. As you see, it changes direction with the rotation. So without a doubt, there is a rotating field within this armature as it spins and the rotation from an outside perspective now the quicker the rotation goes the physical rotation the quicker the magnetic fields gonna rotate they're mechanically linked so join the forum to see what happens when you induce an output coil with magnetic rotation that's traveling the opposite way as the physical rotation. What happens to the drag? You might be surprised.